Andrea, what makes AC immune so special? In short, it's the people, the technology and the products. So coming to the first point, the people, we um, have been able to select very special people, special um, in terms of their scientific knowledge and experience, and special in terms of their entrepreneurial spirit. In fact, uh, the whole team shares the um, motivation to win. So the passion to win is one of our biggest values in ACMU. The second point is our technology, which allows to discriminate between um, sick proteins and healthy proteins, like in Alzheimer, where you have actually normal occurring protein in the body, which then change their structure and become abnormal, or what we call misfolded. So this immune can actually discriminate between the sick and healthy proteins, and for that reason develop drugs which are very specific, and potentially have very few side effects. And the second one is our products and the speed to market. Um, we have been very successful in um, bringing preclinical projects in a short time to the clinic. In fact, our antibody against the plaques and Alzheimer took us exactly four years. And also the other products uh, of um, our portfolio, we will actually succeed in bringing them into the clinic in uh, four years. What country best facilitates starting a tech company? I think this is a very personal question. Uh, there are certainly many countries uh, where you can uh, start a biotech. We have um, decided to do that in Switzerland for many reasons. One is the excellent science um, in Switzerland and we uh, quality of the scientists available. In fact, we are very lucky to be on the campus of the local EPFL University, which is a source of uh, science, a source of uh, scientists, and a source of support. Specifically, uh, Professor Ebischer, the president of the university, really supported the company from the starting point. The second aspect of being in Switzerland is uh, the international situation with many languages and thirdly and not unimportantly is the um, investor um, source which you have based on the um, many pharmaceutical companies and uh, last not least is the governmental support which in fact would like to promote bioscience and specifically neuroscience in the region very well. Andrea, what makes an innovator? An innovator is, in part, I strongly believe, genetic. And um, these are people who have um, creative ideas, but these are also people who have a strong implementation capabilities and the passion to win. Innovators must lead effectively teams and motivate teams. Um, and they must have the ability to take risk. In fact, innovators are the most difficult positions in a company, in a small and a big one, and requires a lot of um, creativity, passion to win, and uh, motivation to do so. How does AC Immune contribute to improving the state of the world? Let me maybe first um, say a few things about the disease we are working on, Alzheimer. Alzheimer is a terrible disease affecting many people's and um, their family's life. To give you a few numbers, uh, today there are 5 million people with Alzheimer in America. There are more than 26 in the world and uh, the health costs related to uh, the uh, care of the Alzheimer people in America is already today more than 140 billion. Um, it's a money but it's also the uh, the uh, problem which this disease brings to the patients and the families. Is immune has a technology which uh, has a great potential to develop products which can stop the disease uh, with an enormous impact on the economy as well as on the society. And we think that um, this potential is very much consistent with a vision of uh, the World Economy Forum to uh, impact uh, economy and uh, society with the technological breakthrough.